Hello guys and welcome back into a new brand video. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to refresh your sandboxes in Salesforce. So make sure to watch the video to the end and follow these simple steps. So simply, all we need to do is just to go to the sandboxes in setup. So we we'll click here, we go to our setup, and after that, we need to search for our sandbox. In the quick find, just type sandbox. And then we need just to search for our environment. Here, we will find all our sandboxes. So you can go to the sandbox history to find when you have created all your sandboxes, etc. And one of the action that we can find either clone, delete, and refresh. So simply, all you need to do is to click on refresh. By clicking on refresh, you can uh, refresh the name of the sandbox. And basically, you will need just to click uh, on uh, next, etc. So make sure to not waste your licenses. And you will need just to click on next and give it an auto activate if you'd like or until you activate it and add data storage, etc. etc. You give it a, uh, a sandbox access, which is it might be in some group that you all have. So in the public groups. So you can add them here and you will need just to click on create. So basically after that, you will need just to wait for a while. So you can wait for the sandbox to be uh, totally refreshed and that would start uh, have the status completed. And then you can click on login so you can be able to access again to your sandbox and you will need uh, or you will be able to log in into it. So as you can see, you can click on login and you will need just to add the password for it. So that's it. Thank you for watching and see you next time.